New developments this evening on a murder spree across the Gulf Coast. Authorities have released new video and information on Billy Boyette. He's the man accused of killing four women last year before eventually committing suicide. News 5's Cody Long has more on that and what an autopsy report reveals. The man who police say went on a week-long deadly crime spree along the Gulf Coast turned the gun on himself inside of a Georgia hotel just over a year ago. Billy Boyette was caught there in February 2016 along with Mary Craig Rice. She is now being charged as his accomplice. There have been questions whether or not Rice was willingly helping Boyette or if she was being forced to. This is newly released surveillance video from outside Greer's Cash Saver on Lillian Highway in Pensacola. You can see a dark SUV in a white car pulling up. Rice and Boyette get into the car with some bags and drive away in that vehicle belonging to one of the victims. Prosecutors could argue that this behavior proves that she was an active participant in the murders and had a chance to get away since she was in that car by herself. Four women were killed in three counties. Alicia Greer and Jacqueline Moore from Santa Rosa County, Kayla Crocker in Escambia, and Peggy Bros in Baldwin. The autopsy report also reveals Boyette shot himself in the head at the hotel as he sat against the wall with three weapons nearby. Also, no drugs or alcohol were found in his system at the time. Rice just recently made a court appearance this week. She'll be back in court at the end of May. In Pensacola, Cody Long, WKRG News 5, local coverage you can count on.